Begin this test by connecting your DMM probes for the ohmmeter connection. All right, I have the Elvis MX DMM operating. I'll select the ohmmeter mode and pick the 200 ohm range to get us started. The first thing you, sh you should check is to ensure that you have uh, roughly zero ohms resistance for the DMM probes. I'm getting around a tenth or a couple tenths of an ohm this way. Another check you might try is you could pull a resistor from your kit. This is a 2.2K resistor. And when I measure the resistance between the resistor terminals, looks like I need to choose a higher range here. Pick 20 kilo ohms for the range. And I see a measured value of 2.20K. Another thing you can try is just common items around the house. This is a 40 watt, 120 volt incandescent light bulb. And one conductor is in the screw or the silver screw ring there. The other is at the tip of the bulb right here. Let's see if we can find out what the resistance is of the tungsten filament for this bulb. And we'll measure the resistance. I'll use the specify range and I know the resistance is supposed to be pretty small so I'll pick 200 ohms for this. And initially I'm just making relatively light contact with the probes and you'll notice that the measured value tends to jump around a little bit. When that happens you can try to get a little bit more forceful contact so I'm using a little more pressure here and we get a much more stable reading of just over 25 ohms.